How do you control yourself when you are full of rage and want to keep calm? Clean the shit out of everything. If my house smells like strong bleach you know I'm mad. I learned to do this one as well. My wife knows if she comes in and the kitchen is spotless that I've had a bad day. Few things better than taking all that energy and forcing it to do something legitimately functional. I'm too physically big to be that guy who hits the wall or yells at the kids. I don't want my family to fear me the way I feared my father. So, I clean. I don't particularly like cleaning, but I'd rather spend an hour scrubbing a bathroom floor than have my children scared when I enter the room. Direct correlation between anger level and bleach concentration. I think to myself can I do the jail time? Usually the answer is no. Or do I have the money to replace what I break? I wait 5 years and if I still remember what I was angry about I murder them robbery gone wrong style. The trick is wear some funky sneakers and a nice scarf so the news will be looking for some fabulous looking stabber. If you get arrested you have no motive, oh that thing 5 years ago? Now nah, we solved all nice and friendly like. Controlled breathing and music. Am I doing it right? Ah yes, Hamon and the Pillamen theme. I go outside and walk, paying attention to my breathing, unless it's dark, then I stare at the stars. Always overwhelms me. Nature is so calming. Cries in 8 million people city sky. I worked with preschoolers and I find zones of regulation super helpful, even as an adult. Basically, it's having an awareness of your emotional state. You have the green, blue, yellow, and red zones. If you can notice that you're entering the red zone, you can take steps to recenter yourself before you go into an all-out rage. This is a great preventative method, but what do you suggest if you find yourself already in the red zone? I work with little kids, too. There's a PBS show called Daniel Tiger, and they have all of these little songs about handling emotions. One of them is when you feel so mad that you wanna roar, take a deep breath and count to four. I do this with the kids, but I also use it myself. It actually works, and also makes me feel really silly because I can't do it without thinking of the cartoon Tiger singing it, and that takes me out of the moment, which helps too. I isolate myself and count to a number between 10 and 50, depending on how full of rage I am. When you feel so mad that you want to roar, take a deep breath and count to 4. And then punch as many people as you counted to. I isolate myself. Same here, but I listen some music. When I'm sick of dull and dreary, when I'm weary, all at sea, when I'm feeling tired and teary, stuck with nowhere else to be, when I'm feeling sad and lonely, when I'm down for something new, when I'm lost and really only at a loss for what to do, then I make the choice to do it, close the door and turn the key, take the chance to settle to it, spend the time alone with me. I start to clean something. Literally anything. Lol I do this too. Blast rage against the machine and clean the shit out of my house. Rage cleaning is effective as hell. Then when I've calmed down I benefit. I told my oldest son not to talk to me when I'm cleaning and there is no music going. Then explained why I said it's the perfect time to work out any aggression so I don't say something I don't mean to someone in the house. I have a punching bag at home named Kyle, stay calm, Kyle's at home and he deserves my juvenile temper tantrum, not other people. I have a brother named Kyle. Same principle. Best of luck to you and Kyle. I just start crying. I cry when I get angry and then I get angry a BC I'm a control freak and I can't stop crying so it's just a spiral situation. Happens very rarely but when it does, I usually isolate myself and just let it happen. Same. Headbang on loud music. This one works for me too. Had a very ugly fight with my little brother once, and to calm myself down, I headbanged so hard to hell's bells, I thought my head will fall off. Hold it in so long that you implode into a desolate unfeeling meat sack. Numb isn't angry a myriad? 
Psychotic rage intensifies you definitely are. Ah. Oof this one hits home. Wishing you healing friend. I think about this gay vampire I met and start counting prime numbers. Gay huh? Most vampires just want to suck your blood. Enacting the plan to reach heaven TM would be a good next step. I close my eyes and count to 10. It works most of the time, but then I got fired. Bus driver. Hey kids, learn this. SKRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRR